Hello everyone, my name is Luchar, and this is Eco Global Survival, a single player Let's Play. Uh, in this episode, we got some big plans. Uh, the main thing we're going to do, we're going to work on our workshop over here. We are going to, well, we're going to finish it. <laughs> get our walls up, get our ceilings up. Oh, hey, look, you can see our refineries over there. Oh, nice pollution in this pond. Compost is building up. I might have to build an extra uh, stockpile for that. Anyway, so we're going to do our, we're going to get our workshop done. That's going to be a big priority today. Our other big priority is going to be to learn electronics so that we can build the uh, electronics assembly, I think it's called. Yeah, electronics assembly. And that will, that's a big late game uh, workbench. It gives us lots of other options. So it'll be going obviously over in the new workshop once it's done. So that's why we need to get the workshop done first. Uh, the other big thing I think we might do today, well, we might learn fertilizers today and do that. That mm, that might be in a future episode. You dead? No. I think we might look for gold today. I have this little uh, hole dug out over here. <laughs> I dug down pretty far looking for gold. And I never found any. Like I went down pretty far. So I might go down a little bit further, see if we can find gold. If not, I may go uh, over to the coal biomes again, because apparently gold also spawns there. So anyway, that's the big three for today. We're going to finish the workshop. We're going to learn electronics. We're going to find gold. And if there's time uh, and we have a skill point available, we might get into fertilizers as well. Oh, you know, and I guess the other thing today as well is we're going to get into uh, some of the advanced baking stuff. Um, get out of the way, please. Thank you. So we're currently making uh, some pastry dough here. So we're so we're leveling up in baking. I think we're already up to four here. So we'll, we can make elk wellington now. So we're going to make some elk wellington. And what was it? Fruit tarts was the other thing I think I was going to make. Yeah, because Elk Wellington is uh, mainly protein and fat. Fruit tart is mainly carbs and vitamins. So those should balance out decently. I may have to take advanced cooking at some point as well. This sweet salad looks pretty good. That's a lot of carbs and, and vitamins. And more closely balanced than the, the tart is. Simple syrup. Fruit salad basic salad anyway workshop electronics gold advanced baking is back is the plan for today so i'll be back with an update soon so i'm currently looking for gold and i am way down deep here and there's still no gold i'm gonna climb out of this hole just to give you an idea of how far down i came it's uh quite a hole Basically, the prospecting tool was almost going all the way to, to the bottom, to bedrock, and there was still no gold. So, starting to think that maybe this biome isn't the spot to look for gold right now. Maybe I'll try the cold biomes, because that kind of sucked. <laughs> and even if there is any way down there, I don't even want to think about how long it would take me to dig down there you know, wide enough that I could get the car down there, right? So I'm going to go check the cold, bio cold biomes. Actually, before I do that, I'm going to work on the workshop for a bit. But but before we do that, I should have my first elk wellingtons done. So let's go have a delicious elk wellington or two. Ah, yes, they're there. I don't want them outputting there, though. Let's output to here instead. All right, so let's see. Uh, it's good. We're a little short on protein and fat right now, which is perfect. Oh, yeah. Stomach is full. We only needed to eat one. That's crazy. All right, so we got those. Now let's make some uh, fruit tarts, I believe, was the plan. So let's fire some of those up. Those are quick compared to the Elk Wellingtons anyway. Nice. Oh, now we're heavy on the fat. 
So we need some vitamins. So we'll just eat some vegetable soup. Just to get rid of it because it's vitamin heavy. All right, so I will be back with a workshop update soon. All right, so I got the walls done. Uh, they're, they're five high. One, two, three, four, five. So if I put the roof on top, oh, meteor update, 22 days, 15 hours, almost 16 hours. Uh, so if I put the roof on top, I feel like that'll be high enough, hopefully for any uh, work tables that need to go in here. I feel like this will be big enough as well. It looks a little smaller now that the walls are up, but I there's only like three tables I think that need to go in here. So it should be fine. Now I just need to decide what color I want to make the ceiling. Do I have enough of the redwood for the ceiling? That's what the floor is made of, redwood. I might have to go with the lighter color. How much redwood? Oh, there's all kinds of redwood. So 40, 80, 100, 20, 300. How big is it? I can do the math here right quick. So it's 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14 by 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12. 14 by 12 is what? Calculator time. It's way less than 300, I know that. Hundred and sixty-eight. So we're gonna make the ceiling the same color as the floor. And that is my next plan. I will be back when that is done. If I don't uh back off into the off the road here. <laughs> uh much like real life, I cannot back up worth the crap. Good stuff, good driving, Luch. There you go. Ooh. There, that's fair enough. Alright, I will be back soon. So I realize that we're kind of lacking. We don't have a carb heavy food. So I'm going to do some macaroons. They are quite carb heavy. They're also fat heavy. We need some better protein. Stuffed turkey good for protein? There, yeah, there's our protein fix. So that's what we're doing now. We're going to do some macaroons. We're going to do some stuffed turkey. That'll give us a poor, poor dish rotation like we were doing with the previous tier, I guess you could say. So let's do some macaroons. Cue them up, and then let's cue up some stuffed turkey as well. We had to make some bread. Get the stuffed turkey on the go. It uses a lot of those prime cuts. That's okay. All right, so we got those queued up, ready to go. Just trying to keep our uh, our stomach balanced. So let's go because the workshop has been completed. I did a smart thing this time. I built stairs so I could uh, get up to make the roof. Look at that. All done. Here's my little stairs. Roof looking good. If I need to put a windmill or anything up here, I can. I doubt it, though. I doubt it's going to want mechanical power. I'm sure it's going to want electrical power. So I might have to put another one of those engines in. Depends how much electricity it needs. So that means we need to learn electronics. Probably should have done that ahead of time, but, you know, <laughs> is what it is. This could be hard. I mean, in theory, this is probably, like, the hardest book in the whole game, right? So, 10 of any modern, 10 of any advanced, 15 of any basic. That's not a problem. Metallurgy modern. This might be a problem. Okay, no, that's just steel and uh, rivets. Rebar, sorry, not rivets. We'll have to go get some... About to make some rebar, but that's fine. Okay, and then five engineering modern. That is all this iron. So we're gonna have to make a bunch more of these iron products, which is fine. And metallurgy advanced. What's that? Oh yeah, well we can do that one right now. How many metallurgy advanced do we need? Five. All right, let's get the party started. Cue that up. Get those on the go. And then I will start making everything else that we need. And I will be back when we have that ready. So the electronic skill book is currently being made. Still seven and a half, almost eight minutes left before that's done. So I just wanted to check in on our little farm over here. Uh, looks like the corn is much closer to being fully grown. Uh, tomatoes, how many are we going to get? We got five. 
five, five. So we're getting five tomatoes per pole now. Much better than the one we got earlier. So it took, uh, I mean, it took some time for them to really grow. That's a lot of tomatoes, and let's grab the corn, but this will leave us only three corn purse. The corn must take longer. So now these are empty. So let's go grab some more corn seeds from our seed storage and replant them, or do we want to try something else? Now I wonder if the potato potatoes, tomatoes, I wonder if they grew better because corn, where's corn? Corn yield potential is just red here, right? But if I go to tomatoes, it's much brighter, right? You get yellow and even almost white there. So I wonder if that's why. So what beets do also grow here, but beets were better somewhere else close, I think is why I didn't go with beets. Should probably turn off tomatoes, shouldn't I? So many beets. The beets were only red, but and then there was like white beets over here. So I was planning to grow the beets over there. Wheat, maybe, I should be growing here. How's the wheat? Uh, close the beets off again. Let's take a look at wheat. See, wheat's not very good there. Of course, it's not very good anywhere except here, but this is pollution central. I'd rather not grow anything there. But maybe I should. Now, you know what? As long as I have the wheat seeds, I'm going to grow them here. I know it's not great, but it's better than nothing. All right, so I'm going to run back and grab some wheat, and uh, we'll come back and plant them. All right, so it's hard to see, but I did plant some wheat here. Uh, so it'll grow eventually, of course. And tomatoes, I guess, will regrow, which is nice. Um, which is nice. I, I guess that's why tomato seeds seem to be more rare, because they're kind of OP, because it's, uh, I guess, an, an annual plant or whatever it would be called. I don't know. I'm not a botanist. So we got some wheat down, we got some tomatoes down. We are, like I said, we are going to expand our farming operations eventually. We're going to go over here. I think it's over around here. Uh, both green beans and beets, I think, are really good over here. I guess they're just beans. You know they are green beans. No, green beans were over... Well, right here, I guess. <laughs> just not here, apparently. Yes, yeah, so we can do some beans up here. And then we'll do some beets over here. Or something else that grew over there, though. What about um, huckleberries? Yes. Oh, huckleberries are also here. So but I'm going to wait until I get the fertilizers for that. And we'll do the soil sampler. And we'll try to really maximize it. Because I'm curious if the fertilizer does it make it grow faster. Or does it just increase the yield? Or you get the higher yield faster, I guess. So we'll look into that. We'll fire around with that. Uh, but for now, our uh, electronics book is almost done. So uh, we will go uh, grab that here in two minutes. Just over here moving some more oil barrels around again. And I got to be honest, the whole thing where you lose barrels every time. Like just for example, if I put in 10... Yeah, well, let me put in 10. <laughs> if I put in 20, I only get 15 back. That is super annoying. I hope once I get a better module in here, it's even and I stop losing barrels. Because I'm all, to be honest, I'm getting sick of making barrels all the time. But it is what it is. It's not the end of the world. And now that we have the electronics table, let's just get one better. The next module for sure. But I can't remember if the fourth one is in... It's either in the advanced carpentry table or the advanced masonry table. If it's carpentry, we can do it. If it's masonry, we cannot as of yet. So let's just check right quick here. Okay, it is carpentry. That is awesome. And it just needs composite lumber, which we have all kinds of kicking around. Beautiful. All right, so let's go learn electronics. And we will queue up the, uh, the table that we need. Electronics, yes, sir. Boom. 
epoxy. There we go. Got a lot of epoxy built up, but I'm pretty sure you need it for a lot of um, that, like the next tier stuff. So, oh, I guess it would help if I actually learned the skill, right? That usually helps, I think. Oh yeah. All right, so what's it called? Electronics assembly. We have what we need. It's twelve and a half minutes for this table, though. So we will have to come back for that. One thing while we wait here is I got some, get some points, some, some uh, perks to take. Milling. We'll take solo table, of course. Probably should have taken that a long time ago. We do, yeah, we'll do lavish for sure. Oh, and farming perks. What will the farming perks be? Oh, I guess there is technically a table, the farming table. I was thinking it, perks would be different because there was no table. But there is a farming table. Industry perk. Go lavish. Yeah. Um, what do we got here? A little advanced baking. Go for the old solo table. Should have taken this a while ago. I got to remember to do these earlier. Uh, this one I'm going to have to check on. <laughs> Come on, let me take it. Get out of the way. Get out of the way, tooltip. Alright, so I'm just going to check and see the room requirements of the... Oh no, it's baking. The, the oven's are old. It's, surely it's not... The requirements for this should be low. Once we get in advance, get out of the way. Get, I will kill you. I don't care. Yeah, you better run. Actually, I kind of need... I am getting low on meat because of all the prime cuts, so I should probably maybe go hunting here <laughs> someday soon. So this only needs 1.8. So yeah, we'll definitely do a lavish table for this. There's that out here. We do need to get advanced cooking. Sometime soon. Alright, so that should help. What do we got here? It's smelting. Oh yeah, this is... I don't understand this one because the tables are outside. So I guess just take lavish table, right? Can't add anything when there isn't anything, right? And then we got composites, I assume. Yeah. And we'll go lavish table here. Beautiful. Alright, so now we just need to wait uh, about 10 minutes for that... Uh, Kill book, and we will be uh, we'll be ready to go. I'll be back. All right, all right, all right. Our new table is done. Electronics assembly. Let's go. Let's go over the new workshop. Or workshop. It's been empty. Just sitting. Just sitting empty. Just waiting for something to get put in it. Well, here it is. Oh, let's put this in the corner. Looks like it belongs in the corner. Link you up. And what can we make? Not much right now. <laughs> Ooh, fiberglass. Need plastic and glass. We have that. Gold flakes. So, yeah, we're going to need gold because gold flakes, gold flakes. Computer lab. Technically, we could make. No, we definitely can't make advanced circuits yet. Electric motor. Basic circuit. No. Electric wall lamp. We could technically make that, I think. Yeehaw. <laughs> Robotic assembly line. Servos. Where do I even make servos? Substrate. What is substrate? That is fiberglass and epoxy. What is substrate used for? I don't see it anywhere. I'm sure it's used for some annoying things, though. And modern upgrades need basic circuits all right so we're not getting any more upgrades without gold so we're gonna have to go find gold here soon fiberglass we could do though that would let us get um the best tools right i think i think we could make those because we didn't have fiberglass but now we do i believe modern tools yeah we just need fiberglass for most of these so maybe we will move some glass over and some uh, 
rubber, I think, is what I need to write. Or is it epoxy? Rubber, or plastic, not rubber, plastic. I'm going to have to make more plastic as well. So let me queue up more barrels. I forgot to do that. But anyway, all this is going to have to be in the next episode. So that's going to be all for this one today. I hope you enjoyed it. If you did, please leave a like, subscribe if you haven't already. Be good to each other. And I'll see you in the next one where we will have a barrel of fun. Hopefully. <laughs>